Hey guys. Hello. Okay, so now we're going on a little bit of adventure. You want to tell our audience where we're going? Yeah, we are going to go to Walmart, Wally World, at the very last minute because our coffee maker died. Sad face. And we're also on Whole30. And like, because we don't drink a whole lot of soda or juices anyways, like we kind of appreciate our coffee. Yeah, and did you know guys that we're actually... Hey guys, um, my name's Evie. Um, we're doing lip balming, and we have to go to the end of the page. This one, um, the peppermint chocolate chip one. Well, what ingredient are you going to go get at Wally World? Um, chocolate chips. So, usually we do not go to Walmart. We're just, like, not really Walmart people. We're more, like, Target people. But, um... I like their toys. <laughs> you like all the toys. We got our last uh, coffee maker, actually, at Walmart. So, I'm like, hey, let's just go there. I literally want the exact same one. Because one, we gotta like buy the freaking cup, and two, just all the waste. It's just yeah. silly to throw all that stuff away. Coffee grounds you can recycle and use again. Okay, guys, we found the exact same coffee maker, so I'm like pretty stoked. And I'm pretty sure that this is five or six dollars cheaper than the price it was a few years ago. Oh, look, Hocus Pocus, Rainbow Pony. Oh, of course, Evie goes to the Rainbow Pony Princess outfit. It has wings, and it's a good price. Jamie, but. does this look familiar? Because this totally looks exactly like your tie-dye shirt. Okay, so we just finished up at Walmart. Our total was definitely more than I think you expected. <laughs> yeah. Um, do yeah. You, and also the trip was an hour. Do you have any regrets? Of course not. It's time with you and time with Evie, and we're like just being with each other. But are you like annoyed? No. I didn't have a specific outcome other than to spend time with you and time with Evie and we were gonna go have this time, you know, together as a family out of the house. Yeah, it's cool. We're gonna get home, she's gonna get dessert, medicine, bed. We got our routine, you know? Yeah, I guess I know a lot of husbands would be kind of upset with their wives for like, you were only gonna go in for a coffee maker and some chocolate chip morsels like how did you come out with $60 worth of stuff yeah you're gonna get like like put a guy in a tool shop and you're gonna get the same kind of creep right the, it's I went to get this thing but then I saw this other thing and I shared this other thing we all do it right we all have access to that expansion ability and it's so if I the average person they're gonna be like look you were gonna go in you're gonna get this the very tunnel vision very producer like just produce the outcome you know, and and I'm at a point in my life and just recognizing, yeah, there's a time and a place for that, but does it have to be every single moment of every single day of every single outing? It has to be, let's go get it, kill it, get it home and be done. That's part of the beauty of our marriage is that you're, <laughs> you get me out of the ivory tower and get me out of my head and get me into my body. Case of abundance and gratitude. Yeah, no, nah, it's fine. We'll figure it out. <laughs> Abundance means you know there's plenty more available. There's you don't, always more. Yeah, you don't have to limit and cut off and close off. And that affects our daughter because, you know, she's more confident, more outgoing. She's not rushed all the time. Sometimes she is because sometimes we got to get stuff done. You're taking too long. Yeah. Yeah, so. Yeah, and sometimes I get crabby. Sometimes we all get crabby after stuff. Okay. You don't get crabby after stuff. <laughs> oh, child. Thank you for your vote of confidence. See you later, Mr. Coffee. See you, you later, Gator. You were.